previously in Skyrim. It may be dead now, but where did it come from? Um, the sky, I would imagine. It's Why are you standing them. inside the dragon? Just as a courier would. I have placed the items in the delivery chest. Hmm. But I still fear there is more I can offer. More? Come on, ladies. We're off to see the capital of Skyrim. First time to solitude? It is. Hi, you Corin. You forgive me. I'm rather preoccupied. Thus, I have no desire for uh, idle chit-chat. I'm not here for chit-chat. You uh, have to forgive me. Shakar. Shakar sent me. Lydia, today... It has been a very productive week. Something tells me... We about to become filthy rich. Have you made your shopping list yet? Start writing. And now... Well, ladies, our future is definitely looking bright. But we've got a lot of work to do. He mentioned something about going over to... Winterhold? That's a long ways away. It is, however, closer to Iverstead. Well, kind of. <laughs> it's kind of closer to Iverstead. <laughs> um, in a way, it's actually about the same length away as we are now. But we gotta get going that way. Anyways, so... I think we are gonna put it on hold, however. Because I do want to make it up that bloody mountain. Oh god, we're all the way over in Solitude. I think maybe the first order of business will be to go up to the Helmet city. Helmet doesn't block out the sun, boss. No. No, it doesn't. Because it's not a helmet. It's a hood. <clears throat> Anyways, we're gonna go up to the city and we're gonna go... Woo! Did you guys feel that? That was weird. I was hoping that doesn't happen again. <clears throat> Felt like game lag. You don't know what game lag is. Because this is your world. It's not my world. And again, if you guys can hear me, you aren't talking. Okay, yeah. Um, next order of business, I'm tired. It was a long carriage ride and an even longer conversation. And I also am a bit hungry. So let's head up to the city and find ourselves an inn. Hi, Mr. Guard. Nothing to see here, I promise. We're not doing anything suspicious. Just about to make a lot of money. A whole lot of money. Which is something I never had in my past life. So I'm really looking forward to it. Hi. If you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricca. I mean, I haven't. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here. Or you'll end up like Rogvir. Who's Rogvir? I'm gonna find out, aren't I? I know who Rogvir is, but just play along. Okay. Thanks for the advice. Honestly, playing ignorant sometimes is the hardest part of living in this new world. And, like, why this world? I'll never understand, first of all, how this happened to me, and secondly, why this world was the one that was chosen. Like, I know just about everything that's going to happen. There are some new things. Like you, you're new. You 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 didn't exist before. You're you're a new person, so that's cool. And this whole merchant trading thing, that's new, and I love that. Still I love here. that there are new things for me to experience by being here. But still, why this world? Exactly. Whatever deity hell, it probably was a Daedra. I mean, I did just piss off Molech Ball, and now he's making tiny, subtle changes to my world, almost like he's modding the game. It's weird. And I know, you guys have no idea what I'm talking about. Hell, I don't even know if I'm actually talking to you because, well, when I look at myself, I'm not moving my lips. 
And the fact that I can sit here and look at myself like this is very unnerving. But I'm getting used to it. Let's go in and get some food, shall we? And maybe a nice sleep? I'm tired. Very unnerving. Whoa. Tell them he didn't do it. Position. Tomorrow you need to go home. Okay, yeah, I know this is my first time into solitude, but Lock this, the city is, gate. this is not exactly the solitude Traitor. I remember. Again, you it's like the game us. is modern. You should tell her that her uncle is scum that betrayed but I'm his not high in the game. King. Best she know now, Advar. You're all heart. Let's grab Robert. some flowers. Ulfric Stormcloak escaped the city after he murdered High King Tori. We are sisters of battle. I would be shamed into some god if I did such a thing. There was no murder. Ulfric no, you should be. Would you two Fair please combat. stop? Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords. Come down. Trying really hard. Very well, Rogvir. Bow your head. To ignore the fact that you and Lydia keep having the same conversation over and over again, but it's getting really hard. On this day, I go to Sonnengard. I don't want to watch that. Ah, okay, okay. We're we're moving on now. Oh, Lydia, hi. You're I've got you're not back. normally the one that's standing there. It confused me Some for a moment. Gate guard, you I are. Never See, look, this that's cold. a different color. That's a different color. Is it not? It's supposed to be that color. It's. I'm so. It's weird. Okay. Enough. Enough, enough. I, I. He died well. Ah. Food. Pardon me. Bed. Now. Come on in. No more confusion. No more confusion. Oh. Take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. Mood lighting. It looks nice. But this is exactly what I've been talking about. This is not how this normally looks. Watch yourself, boss. But it looks really <coughs> nice. Oh, <sighs> sorry. I'm just, I'm admiring the scenery. Spare some gold for a veteran? Can I have some wine, boss? I have no business with you. I Leave me. Oh, sorry. I've here in solitude for a long oh, time. Oh, my war. God. War follows a man until it's done with him. Does everybody in the bar want to tell me their life story? I swear I've already had that conversation, too, in Whiterun. He hello, hello, Barkeep. I'm Gizly. Welcome to the Winking Skeever, friend. I don't... Everyone does. <laughs> sorry, Barkeep. I don't know why she was talking to me. I would uh, like a room, please. I'm... Kind of tired. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. <laughs> uh, tell me about your bar. Well, as it turns out, I had a pet skeever when I was a boy, and he used to wink. Okay. You kept a pet skeever? They were smaller back then. Easy to steal from drunk. Got it. Heard any rumors lately? People say there's a man wandering the streets near the Blue Palace. He seems distressed, but he's not making any sense. I really should not be doing this. I have enough quests to worry about already. Anything else? Varnius Junius stopped by here on his way to court. He was worried about something. I'm sure Falk Firebeard could tell you what. And I'm sure I will care eventually. Right now, I'm just... Anything more? I've heard Jari Raz hanging around the Wells District, looking for new blood to hire. Uh-huh. There's a lot going on, isn't there? What else you got for me? I think the Bard's College might be looking for recruits. You should speak to the head of the college, Viarmo, if you're interested. Okay. Is that all? People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face, make you look completely different. Yeah, I heard that mm -hmm. one in Whiterun. I heard that one in Whiterun. Oh, okay. Um, how about some magic? Can I learn magic here? Magic? You're on the wrong side of Skyrim. 
You want Winterhold. That college there, they teach it. Otherwise, you can try the Jarl's Wizard. I wouldn't, though. As it turns out, I'm actually uh, going to be headed to Winterhold soon. But first, I have to climb up a mountain. All right, well, thank you I'll for the room. I'll show you to your room. Oh. Right this way. Right. Hello, I'm Gizli. But you can just call me Erica's sister. Oh. Everyone does. Uh... Welcome not to the to be center of the world, rude, but since you or at least my brother Eriker's world. Yeah, not to be rude, but since you uh, started this conversation, uh, who is Eriker uh, besides your brother? Yes, my older brother, and the person you probably want to be speaking to right now. But really, since Torig's death, Falk Firebeard wields the true power of the Jarl's court. My brother is nothing more than a pompous little fop. Ah. So you really hate your brother. That's obvious. And it sounds like you might have good reason to as well. I'm gonna just... We'll speak again later, if we must. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, I, I have... You know, you know, I understand... <clears throat> the whole not liking your siblings thing. Um, oh crap, I didn't follow him to my room. Uh, okay, well, we'll just, oh, okay, it's the open door, because he probably opened the door. All right, I need a snack before bed, because I'm not going to bed hungry. How about some beef stew? That sounds good. And now for a nap. I'm gonna sleep till morn and morning. Morn, listen to me. Oh, look at that. That looks cool. Can't remember when I slept in a warm bed, boss. <coughs> Probably couldn't sleep in one now. Wow. That looks really cool. I better not take it. I better not. All right, let's just go to sleep. Are you guys going to just sit, stand watch out there or get beds yourselves? Look at these potion bottles. I don't recall that. Never mind. Yep, let's get... Oh, I'm, I'm really tired. Let's get a good 12 hours and then we will hop the carriage and figure out where to go from there. Okay, a little bit of breakfast. Oh, I really don't want to have soup for breakfast. Brook bass. That's not cooked. Uh, how about an apple dumpling? That sounds yummy. That sounds like a really good breakfast. <coughs> uh, hey, Molag Ball. I don't know These if you can. These places are not as nice as I thought they'd be. Shh. I'm trying to talk to a Daedra. Go away. No, go go away. Hey, Molag Ball, if you're gonna keep messing with my game, how about you give me a, a a mod or something that that adds drinks other than alcohol, like milk or water, maybe some juice. God, I miss soda. Coffee. I was never a, much of a coffee drinker in my past I've life, but you back. know what? I'm in a video game. Who knows? Maybe my tastes have changed. I'll give coffee a try. <clears throat> Once. You never know. You just never know. Okay. <clears throat> now, we just got a whole bunch of stuff from the barkeep to do here in Solitude, and we are going to completely and totally ignore all of it. Okay? Because we are leaving this city. Because I usually have a big problem getting into a lot of trouble in this city. <clears throat> and I would prefer to avoid that this time. Like... Yeah, that just... I, I, I just... I, I, I like my head on my shoulders where it... Blah, blah, blah. 
they haven't cleaned up the corpse from yesterday. <laughs> okay, we're leaving now. Oh, carriage man, no carriage man, please be there when I get to the bottom of this hill. Oh, good, you're here, oh. Oh, you set up a little camp, that's cool. Need a ride? I do, I do. My carriage is the safest way to travel. Yeah, it's also the fastest way to get across the land. Wait, especially when you're in a hurry. Where do you want to go? Oh, that is the question. Where do I want to go? I want to go east. That's all I know. I mean, we do need to go to Winterhold. <sighs> I suppose we could pop in... No, because then, if I do that, then I'm going to want to come straight back to Solitude and talk to Dude again. Uh, yeah, I kind of want to avoid that for the moment. Because we really need to get up that mountain. But is Windhelm close enough? Or would I be better going to Riften? I don't know. I genuinely don't know which one would be closer. What do you think? I'm trying to get to Iverstead. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm trying to get to Iverstead, but I can't decide. I can't tell whether Iverstead would be closer to Windhelm? Or if it would be... Well, there's more than Scar right there. I mean... From here to here, it was pretty long distance. And I'm going to get all the way over here. On the other hand, it looks like there's a road that goes right from Riften. Well, out the back way, at least. And it already goes right through to Iverstead. I just got to follow the road. But then again, on the same hand, it almost seems to me like, the fa again, the fastest place to get to would be Whiterun. Because then I just got to go around the mountain. But I... Is that closer than this? This is why we haven't made it to Iverstead so far, because it's easier to go to other places. I just wish my carriage would go... To more locations. That's all. Uh, you know what? It kind of feels like White Run to Iverstead is about the same distance as Windhelm to Iverstead. I'll, it's probably about the same distance regardless of where I go. Um. So I think I'm going to do the thing that avoids the cold the best, and I'm the least likely to get lost in the process. Um, yeah, so we're, we're going to go to Riften. Hope you guys are up for a long carriage ride. Good morning. Where do you want to go? I, pr I think I finally made up my mind. We are headed to Riften. Climb and back, and we'll be off. I think Riften is the closest location. Or at least the most direct to get to Iverstead. Here's hoping it's a short ride. Or there aren't that many distractions. I like that carriage driver. Oh my god, so much for not being cold. Hey, another horse. Oh, you. Hi. You're the one that followed me this time, huh? Alright, alright. I wonder if I can give you a name. Because right now I'm just calling you Wild Horse. Well, you're being called Roach. 
They're, you're all just roach. That, that's 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 all there is to it. I cannot feel my fingers or my toes. Yeah, I know. I don't. I don't understand why it's snowing and rifting. But we're definitely going to go inside and warm up. Hi. Hold there. Oh God. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitors tax. It's kind of cold out here. Can we hurry this up? What tax? For the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Ah, uh, it matters because I'm pretty sure you're a con man and this is a shakedown. All right, keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. Thank you. You are definitely no thieves guild. The gate's unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. Next time, what? Have you heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard? Vampire hunters or something. In the old fort near Riften. Might consider joining up myself. You'd probably be better off as a vampire than a gate guard or a con man, because you suck at both. Have well, you noticed that you your axe looks I like it. But it's just a it's just an iron battle axe. Right? Is that iron? Things are still changing. <clears throat> I'm still thoroughly confused by all of it. I, I need another run in with the Thieves Guild. Be careful, Milo. The Thieves Guild has Maven Blackbriar at its back. One snap of her fingers, and you could end up in Riften Jail. Or worse. Well, at least they still seem normal. I will eat and drink like a Nord warrior. I just don't want you to leave. Finally, you guys are You're arguing about something new. City in a long Thank time. you. Good grief. Okay, let's go in and find a place to warm up. I don't know uh, you. You and Riften looking for trouble? What's it to you? Don't say something you'll regret. Last thing the Blackbriars need is some loudmouth trying to meddle in their affairs. I just want a place to go warm up my bones and maybe get a bite to eat. Who the hell are the Blackbriars? The Blackbriars have rifted in their pocket and the Thieves Guild watching their back. So keep your nose out of their business. Me? I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. Maul? But it'll cost you. Your name is Maul? Is that supposed to be scary? I mean... Tell me what you know. Just stay out of your way. Now, I found this weird gem somewhere. I don't remember where I found it, but do you know anything about it? Only way you could have found one of those is by stealing it. Guess you'll fit in around here better than I thought. No, it was... So what do you want to know? Lying around. I don't actually remember where I found it. Oh, no, I did. It was in the Silver Blood... Um... House. Um... Is the gem worth anything? Do I look like a merchant to you? You're gonna have to take that up with Vex in the Thieves' Guild. Oh. Get in good with them and you'll find her. I take it that's not gonna be all that easy. Uh, tell me more about the, the Thieves' Guild. You kidding? My brother Dirge works in their hideout. I used to run with them myself, but took a job with Maven after they started hitting a rough patch. Uh-huh. If you want to get in on that action, find Brynjolf in the marketplace. Brynjolf. I'm sure he could use someone like you. Okay. Find Brynjolf. To talk about a gem. You know, I've got more important things to do. All right, so if the Blackbriars run this this city, then I better know more about them. Well, you got Maven. She pretty much runs the whole operation. She's got friends in high places, if you know what I mean. She's also got ties to the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves Guild, so basically no one can touch her. Just remember, if she tells you to do something, you damn well better do exactly what she says. She's got ties to the Dark Brotherhood? You say that as if she's literally got them in her back pocket. I highly doubt that. Be seeing you around. Yeah. Be seeing you around. Right after I go find a warm place Still to here. sit. 
Oh god. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? Next time, keep your plans quieter, and nothing would have happened to Why you. Why am I still standing out here? What? Are you telling me you robbed it? Why? Why are you doing this to me? I'm really cold. Look, Chandra, last warning. Pay up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. You know, he's got a valid point there, lady. You okay? Huh? What do you want? You in trouble or something? I owe a great deal of money to someone, and I think they cheated me. I don't know what to do. Well, give me the details. I'll see what I can I do I was to able help. to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and harnesses. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire to pay for the shipment, but it got robbed before it even arrived. Now Sapphire wants her money back, and if I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. Oh, please. They're thieves, not murderers. All right, I'll help. You will? Oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm kind of loaded at the moment, and I'm about to get even more loaded, so... You work at the stables? Yes. Hofgreer took me in when I arrived in Riften about a year ago. I mean, I already know He's this. He's been teaching me everything he knows. Horses are my whole life. Back in Hammerfell, I helped my family raise horses at our farm. I hope to open my own oh. stables one day. But I think it's going to take a lot longer than I expected. So you're an immigrant to Skyrim. That's cool. All right, I'll go talk to Be Sapphire. Be careful with Sapphire. She mixes with all sorts of nasty people. She went into that building, and I'm hoping that means that that's the inn. And where there's an Any inn, luck with Sapphire? there's a warm bed. Dude, I haven't even left your side yet. Give me a chance to actually go coin? talk You've to her. To the right place. Pull up a seat. Oh, good. He people came in here. Riften. Heed my yeah. Word. What's Hi. your problem? The of the about not about the one guy's debt. Uh, I'm here to talk I about it. I knew that stupid kid would try and find a way to weasel out of his debt. Look, this is really simple. I lent him some gold, he promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. Yeah, but, like, you're the reason why he's broke. Look here, I'll just pay off his debt, okay? Don't know why you'd help a stranger like that. But a septum's a septum. Don't care where it comes from. You can tell Shadra his debt's been paid. I'll do that. Each other again. Yeah. Very well, Talon. I don't know what they're I'm doing. I'm looking for work. I need someone okay, to deliver Okay, Shadra. Sapphire. I paid your debt for you. You owe me. Eight. You actually talked her into it? I don't know what to say. I didn't think anyone in Riften even cared what happened to me. Look. I was saving this, but I wanted you to have it. I thought I might need it if Sapphire came for me, but I don't need it anymore. Seriously, dude. She's a thief. Until next time. Not a murderer. You're fine. You Blessings were, of Mara You were never in any real danger. Good day, friend. She, she can't well? get money from Looking a corpse. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. Oh, good grief. Which horses you want? You want to speak to Hofgreer at the stables. I mean, I'm Looking not... Looking for work? I but need someone to got? deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. What kind of message? Ah, well, I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest breeding horses in Skyrim. He agreed to sell. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. Okay. Where the hell do I find it? Well, you said he got locked up. You said he got locked up, so he's in jail. So I gotta go into the jail and... Okay. Okay. I'll be a messenger. Good man. You won't regret it. Head to the Riften Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Riften. You'll be well paid for your time. Uh-huh. So why don't you go talk to him yourself? I'm not exactly comfortable around guards or jails. Definitely not when associates of mine have been locked up. No, I'll meet you outside of town. Right, so you're just as bad. Why is Sibby in jail? No idea. 
But whatever he did, it must have angered Maven. No god would lock up a Blackbriar without the old lady's permission. Ah, I'm beginning to hate this town more and more. I'll meet you outside of town. If it's horses you want, you'll want to speak to Hofgreer. You've the already said that, dude. Go You've on, already then. Said Deliver that. my message to Sibby. Oh, okay. I just came in here for a room and a bite to my eat. My skill in battle is unmatched. Fortunately for you, that skill can be bought. Oh, you're looking to be hired. Well, I've already got two per two two companions, so maybe when I finally dismiss one of them, maybe we'll see. In keep. Welcome to Hi the there. Bee and Barb, my lord. If I can interest you in one of our special if drinks, you've got the let coin. Me know. You're welcome here. Uh, Otherwise, hit the road. You should learn a few things from what your. What can I get you? Me? Barkeep. Wine? Okay. Looking for a place to stay? Uh, yes, yes, that's what I want. A room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. That's I'll all I want. To your room. Is a room, right a bite to eat, a place to warm up, and then we've got to hit the road. I just want a nap. I've done a lot of sleeping. My skill in battle lately. is unmatched. Oh my god. Fortunately for you, that skill can be bought. Shush. Hey, Molak, I know I said something about, you know, the drinks and stuff, but could you also maybe give me something that tells everybody to shut the hell up? Let me know if there's anything else you need. Uh, you <clears throat> went in there, right? Yeah, you did. Okay. I just want a quick nap, okay? It was a long carriage ride, and for once, the carriage driver was very nice. He was quiet, didn't, didn't really talk all that much. It was a pleasant carriage ride, and I just want to get a nap because it was a bumpy road, and I couldn't sleep in the carriage. Also, it's nighttime, so I'm going to sleep till morning, and then we're going to get going, okay? Right after I have a snack because I don't want to go to bed hungry. Okay. Good night, everyone. <laughs> oh, that's much better. Uh, something to, to eat. Uh, hey, look, cooked fish. We'll eat the cooked fish. Okay. It's morning. I have slept a lot lately. But, how do I get down from here? Where's the staircase? Ah, whoa! Why is everyone on the staircase? Come see me in the market if you're looking for the finest custom jewelry in all of Skyrim. Never I've done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you're carrying. Hey, lad. Never done an honest day's work in your uh, life for all that coin you're carrying. Hey, lad. You, you're, you're... You're repeating yourself. Oh, what do you care? It's my money. I'm saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. I can tell. Well, I mean, if you mean by honestly having a normal 9-to-5 job, then sure, no, I haven't. But if you mean by robbing it, no. And again, why do you care? My money's my business. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lad. Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. Oh... You have something for me to do, don't you? What do you want? I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra pair of hands. And in my line of work, extra hands are well paid. And get to the point. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're going to steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. You must be out of your mind. You want me to, to break the law and risk jail. Are you sure you want me to do this? 
And what did Bran Shea do to deserve it? There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. Also, That's who's Bran Shea? I'll be out in the market all day, from 8 in the morning until 8 in the evening. Meet me then, if you've still got the stomach for it. Oh. Why? Why are we doing this? We've been contracted to make sure Bran Shea remembers not to meddle in affairs that aren't his own. Now, since we're not the Dark Brotherhood, we're not going to kill him. We're just going to make sure he sits in the prisons for a few days. Okay, okay. We're not killing anybody. Yeah, you are Thieves Guild, aren't you? How exactly am I supposed to accomplish this? Do you want me to hold your hand as well? You're going to have to sneak over to Medesi's stall and use your lockpick on the strongbox. Then, when you have the ring, you pickpocket Branche and leave it behind. I don't suppose you could be willing to, I don't know, give me more details like who the hell is Medesi and Branche? Where are their stalls? No? No details? You're terrible at this. It's no wonder why you're falling into disrepair. I'll be at the market come morning. Because you can't get all you the details worked too. out beforehand. And you're relying on a complete stranger to help you do it. Ooh. Out of my way, stuff. Thank you, Katya. That was actually amusing. Okay. So yet another person who has an errand for us. Do I look like a courier or something? I'm wearing full metal armor. Silver, but I'm sure they can't recognize that because clearly they think I'm a bag boy. Can't you bother me at my armor stand in the market? Oh. Or are you that desperate for training? No, no, I'm that desperate to get the hell Go on, then. Deliver out my message to Sibby. of this city. Go on then. Deliver my message to Sibby. Uh, Still here. I'm not delivering any messages to anyone. I am leaving. I'm right behind you. Take my advice. Don't listen to that talk of the face sculptor down in the ragged flagon. Face butcher is more like it from what I've heard. Make love like a saber cat. Or crush your enemies to dust like a giant. Only a man I've got your back. I'm going to go absolutely mental if I don't get out of this city, like right now. Where the hell is the door? Hmm. The city has a back door. Oh, your branch. Need something. Just need to know your face. Dead one, boss. What? Here. Hey, don't look at me that way. Who are you to judge me? Dead one? What? Learn a Why are you snapping my head off? What if I have a problem? I know how to deal with it. What problem are you talking about? Protect yourself right. Buy armor from Grelka. Holy crap, these people are so... Trees. They're Open! Here. Reminds me of Autumn at home. Yes. Wow, finally someone who said something that isn't telling me their entire life story at once. Like, these people are very open. This one's got a problem. That one's a thief. This one wants me to steal from somebody. Like, there's no subtlety. None. At all. And hey, look, it's a back door. Can I go out this door, Mr. Guard? Welcome to Riften, home of the Thieves' Guild. Or so they'd have you believe. It's all lice. They're just thugs. Vermin creeping around the rat way. I'm actually getting that exact feeling about them, honestly. But I'm not in coming into Riften. I'm leaving Riften. So we need to make our way to Iverstead. And since there's no carriage that goes there... I've got to do this all... on my own two little feet. You guys ready to climb a mountain? It's gonna be cold, so dress warm. Game of the